and welcome back to Let's Play Story of Seasons, Pioneers of Olive Town. All right, last time, things got a bit wonky at the end there, but everything seems, ugh, seems to be back to normal now. Anyways, I'm gonna get some Mirage Cloth going, and then I'm gonna head to town and go see what those new requests we unlocked are. And then I'm also gonna grab some breeding kits too. And then I'm gonna set up those new barns when I get the chance. Oh, if we're gonna do that, I'm also gonna need some automatic feeders too. You know what, I'll take stock of all that when I get back. Uh, for now though, just gonna do a little bit of prep work before I head to town. Just so I don't forget, I'm gonna grab these, 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 what season are these seeds actually? Are these fall, spring? Okay. Alright, I think we're good. But yeah, I'll get some stuff set up in the fall area later. Oh yeah, I did actually look up what I need for Lovett's request for his food. Uh, turns out my cooking skill just needs to be higher. That's why we don't have the recipe yet. I think I need level 8 or 9 to get it, which is insane, but I guess we've hit that point. I just need to do more cooking, apparently. Oh! Alright, this should be- oh, never mind. I was gonna say this should be easy, but then I saw the number. Um... Okay, 300 iron, 200 silver, 200 solid lumber, and 150 supple lumber. I need to go get more lumber. Well then. Uh, well, it's not grass. Hmm, okay. I think it's time to go on a deforestation mining, like, insane run. I'm going back home. Oh yeah, I'm gonna grab some breeding kits while I'm here. I think I'll set up the new barns tomorrow. Today, I think I'm just gonna dedicate to taking care of the fields and then getting all of my wood and metal and just stick them into the makers and have those going 24 seven. Huh. Oh wait, I can't use a breeding, uh, livestock breeding kit yet. Okay, so who needs to get pregnant? I guess we've been breed yeah, I've been breeding like goats, so I guess we'll get another goat. And I do want to get another rabbit while we're waiting for a uh, turtle pond to grow up. Let's get another gray rabbit, why not? I think tomorrow I'm definitely getting those new barns set up though. Man, now I kinda wish I didn't get that house upgrade. That burned through a lot of my resources. I want that, but I need to think about my future. Uh, what was I looking up again? Right, I wanted to look up the automatic feeders. What do I need for them again? Is it just silver? Oh, it's just silver. Okay. Well, that's easy enough then. Alright, well, I have my work cut out for me. They did give me easier stuff, it's just that they gave me an absurd amount of it. Okay, uh, before I do anything, I'm gonna go over to the fall area. I guess I should also go see the Harvest Sprites later and- Oh, this is in the fire, but that's fine. I should probably go see the Harvest Sprites later. Just grab all the stuff I can get. I guess we're also gonna be going to the mining area a lot more often from now on. I'm not even gonna bother watering today. I'll let the sprinklers do it tomorrow, I'm in no rush. This is just kind of a passive way to get money and crops. Actually, maybe I'll get one more. Because I have flower seeds I also want to plant. That's kind of the reason I came out here. Wait, do I my- wait, did I accidentally put those away? I might put those away on accident. Oh no, there they are. Alright, yeah, I'll just let the sprinklers take care of those tomorrow. Screw it. Uh, what's my inventory looking like, actually? Eh, it's empty enough. Yeah, it's empty enough. I should have plenty of room. Also, I'm just gonna pull up something real quick. Oh, 
I just want to make sure I have the correct type of material. So 300 iron, oh my god, 200 silver, 200 solid lumber, and 150 supple lumber. Uh, I'm gonna give some more to the log sprite. What kind of lumber do I have on me right now? Just, oh, it's Mirage Logs. I mean, I'm gonna need those, but... Maybe I should get, think about starting to get another, like... Whatchamacallit? Maybe I should start thinking about getting another few makers. Also, you know what? I don't need you anymore. I need you, surprisingly enough. Any logs they can collect from me is more logs I don't need to cut down myself. Also, can I just buy- I think I can just buy- oh, is my inventory full? Seriously? Right. And oh my god, that's a lot of junk. Okay, let's get out of here. But yeah, I want to see something actually. Can I just straight up buy lumber? I might be able to buy logs, but I don't think I can just straight up buy lumber, unfortunately. But yeah, I'm going to be working on my lumberjacking skill from now on. Logging. The correct term is logging. Also, these can go on the makers. Uh, I'll need this. You know what? While I'm here... Like I said, I am going to need a ton of materials. So, this is an excuse to go just completely strip mine, uh, what is it called? Stonebreaker Valley. So I'm actually keeping it- oh hey, Ori Calcum. Oh, uh, you know what? Yeah, it might be time to start thinking about getting another maker or two. I think I'm gonna get another ore- or another ingot and another lumber maker. Three probably is- mm, three probably isn't enough, to be honest. Also, there is silver all over my farm I should be collecting as whenever I get the chance. And this is why I usually completely plan ahead for these LPs. This one was a bit of an outlier just because I knew this game. Out of all of them, I think this one probably works the best not having to plan every specific thing out. Because the main quest is like super easy. It's the post-game stuff that's uh, starting to get a little bit rough. Not because it's hard to get everything, it's just the sheer amount of materials is insane. I am at least going to clear out all the Ori Calcum whenever I can. Because yeah, I need to start thinking about getting Ori Calcum tools soon. The hammer is tempting, but I know the fishing rod is mandatory for a spirit quest later on. The axe also probably wouldn't be a bad idea either. There's a lot of ore calcum tools I need to get. Also, I should probably work in getting logging up to level 9 so I can... Um, oh god. Actually, no, I have plenty of food. I'm fine. I should start thinking about getting uh, logging up to level 9 or something. What do I need for makers again? For where are my ingot makers? I think they just require wood. Uh, iron and lo normal logs. Okay, I can make one of those. Also, I might make two of those. And then where is my lumber maker? I really wish there was a way to sort this. Like, all the makers are put together. Am I blind? I'm probably blind. It's up here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Uh, okay, it's just logs. I have plenty of logs. So I guess I can get... I'm thinking two of each would be... I'm gonna stop working before I knock myself out. Yeah, I'm thinking two of each would probably be good. Okay. I didn't completely clear out the area, but that's fine. I cleared out enough of it. Take me home. I have work to do. Okay. So, let me see here. Is there anything I can throw in here for now? Nah. 
Oh yeah, I still have my entire field to take care of too. I uh, kind of forgot about that. Right, I have farm work to do on my farm. Hmm. Are these level 10? No, still level 6, surprisingly. Where did I put all my level 10? There's my level 10 broccoli, finally. Here, I'm gonna throw these in the maker for now. I'm gonna get as much of this done as possible right now, and then I can just concentrate the rest of the day on getting things set up. I also spent so much energy. It might be time to start thinking about maybe investing a little bit into my uh, maximum stamina. I should have the. Am I? Ah, my inventory's full. And my shipping box is full too. Great. Uh, I guess we'll plant what we can for now then. Also, I probably should have done this last. Because the makers are going to need time, and the sooner we get that done, the better. But I've already started, and I'm not going to just abandon it halfway through. I'm just going to finish up here. Why did I do those one at a time? I'll finish up here, and then I'll head over and get everything else taken care of. Okay, sometimes the auto-targeting is just weird. Maybe I'll throw, go, go into my shipping box and see what I can take out of there. Oh, whoops. Oh, are these done too? These are also done. I don't think I have enough seeds. I think I'm short. I'm literally short one seed. I'm literally short one seed. It's already 4 p.m. You know what? Screw it. I'm not going. I'm not going to bother. Here, you know what I am going to do though. Actually, no. I'll just keep my. <clears throat> I'll keep my inventory to keep. Oh wait, perfect. I'll keep my inventory for now. Also, surprisingly, I have a seed maker that's not being used for anything. That feels weird and wrong. Is there anything I can st uh, stick in there right now? Maybe... Eh... Not really. You know what, I have a single round eggplant in here for some reason. Okay. So let's get back to work. Alright, so let me think here. I'm gonna need two more lumber and two more ingot makers, I think. And then yeah, I'm just gonna go crazy and cut down as many trees as possible. So let me take quick stock of what we have then. I'm gonna get everything uh, stacked together first. Okay, so let me see here. We have a ton of silver ore. I think we just need time in that case. Iron, same thing. We just need time. Because I have a lot of iron and silver... What is it? Iron and silver ingots. Yeah, this one's just going to take time more than anything, honestly. Lumber is the other thing, though. This one might be a bit tougher. Because I haven't been as crazy with lumber. Oops with a lumber. So let me see. I need solid and supple. How are we doing in terms of those? I keep hitting right click on accident. Uh, I need more solid. I need more supple. Okay. I have plenty of logs at least. I might... Okay, no. I have plenty of logs. Oh my god. Okay. That works. I'm also gonna grab these for now. So I'm gonna make two of the... Wait. Oh, right, you can't mass produce these because they take up inventory space. You know what? It might not be a bad idea to just make a third one. You know what? I'm going to make three of them. Really go all in on this one. And then I'm going to make three of these. One problem is finding where I can put these. It's going to be a bit disorganized, but that's fine. Um, Yeah, I guess we'll just stick them back here for now. Hold on. Get out of here, trees. I don't need you right now. I guess I can also stick them over here. 
I would like them all together, though, just to make it easier to organize. You know what? Let me move a few things around. I'll put the lumber ones up here. I really have not been using these condiment makers at all. I don't think we really need to, but I really hope I'm wrong. I really hope I'm not wrong on that. Because I have not been making condiments this entire game. Okay. I'll move my jewel makers up uh, closer to the top as well. These ones I don't really need up front and center. It takes so long to make jewels in this game that I'm kind of okay with sticking them in the back over here. What do you mean? Oh, there's a tree there. Of course there is. Also, I have one condiment maker, or one uh, seasoning maker that I didn't put down anywhere. Can I fit here? Yep. Alright, let's go. Half are going to silver, half are going to iron. Iron Fortune takes a lot less time, so this shouldn't be too terrible. So let me see here. So two hours per piece. 20 hours for 10 times 3 is 30, yet yeah, is 30, so 30 a day, and we need 200. I have like 50 already. No, I think I only have 20. Okay, eventually I'm going to start converting those, uh, whatchamacallit, those silver ones into iron ones, I think. Because I have plenty of silver, because I've been building that up throughout the game. I just happened to burn a ton of it on my house upgrade. Okay, so makers are all going. I guess at this point we just need to let them go and it's just kind of a matter of time in this case because I'm pretty sure I have, I might need more supple logs, but I'm pretty sure I have the majority of the materials I need at this point. Oh, um, I'll find a place to dump that stone later. I have the materials I need at this point, I think. It's just really a matter of just time. If I really want... <clears throat> I am also tempted just to maybe make another... Maker or two. Maybe. We'll see. I'm going to grab some more materials while I'm up here as well. Because why not? It's here. I might as well take advantage of that. Also, I need food. Today has been a very busy day. And by busy, I mean physically taxing day. And it's not over yet. I have more trees I need to cut down. Okay. You know, speaking of cutting down trees, uh, yeah, I'm going to put the barn stuff down here. What do I need? I need my axe and I need my sickle. And I thought I was done, cut, uh, done cutting down grass. Apparently, I'm never done cutting... Oops. I am never done cutting grass. Also, do I have room for both down here? Well, only one way to find out. Oh, is the uh, the friggin' puddles? Hold on. I can't put down a bar, and there's a little bit of water on the ground. Actually, if I put it here... Oh, I didn't think of names for these. Uh, what... Friends of Mineral Town, like, Bachelorettes have we not used yet? Actually, we could just use start using Bachelors. Will this fit? Actually, hold on. This might fit, but I need to clear out the area a bit. There we go. And this one can just be... I don't actually know if they use his real name or not in like any of the... in the remake stuff because I didn't really marry him. I think his real name is Trent, but I'm pretty sure they just still call him Doctor and everything. Even after you marry him, which is kind of hilarious. I think. I want to say that's true. 
Really hope I'm not lying on that front. Oh yeah, one other thing I want to do. I want to get some Onmac beaters in there. I'll do that tomorrow, though. It's been a long day. I didn't even get to go fishing today. Also, I don't have room in my shipping box for any of this junk. God, my shipping box is going to be a mess. Alright. Well, anyways. I'll get my inventory and stuff cleaned up and then uh, I'll head to bed. I need to get back to fishing, though. What's my fishing skill at right now? Halfway to seven. I just need to get to seven and we'll be good. Okay. I'm not even gonna bother with that maker. I'll deal with it later. Why did I do that? Oh, actually, do I need more iron? Oh no, I put away the iron, never mind. I was gonna say, did I actually burn through all my iron already? No. That would be crazy, but no. I have not burned through all my iron yet. Okay, we're good. And then I'm just gonna make uh, two of these. And I'll start moving people around tomorrow into the proper barns and stuff. I might need to buy more fodder. Hmm. It's the iron that's gonna kill me. Wait, no. We need 300 iron, huh? Yeah, that iron is gonna be the killing one. It's gonna take so long. Uh, it might be, might be wise to maybe make another few makers. Hmm, maybe I'll think about doing that tomorrow. For now, though, I'm going to bed. Hey, Laura. So, if the entire second area of the bar, or the barn, the entire second area of the farm starts smelling like a smelting plant, uh, just ignore that. It's fine. I've just gone into, like, metal refinement instead. Because the weird mole people told me to. Saying it out loud, that sounds a lot more crazy than it did in my head. Oh, I, I'm i hoping it was ours. Well, sure. I didn't really, but okay. But yeah, we're, uh, we're definitely making headway into getting ourselves a kid. Slowly but surely. Alright, uh, first things first. I need to dump all of this junk. Okay. Wait. Oh no, never mind. I was looking at the wrong number. Alright. So. Yeah, you know what? Screw it. I'm making another three makers. I'll put them somewhere. I'll figure it out later. Uh, for now, let's go take care of the animals. I'll take care of the crops and everything later. Let's just get this started now, just so it'll continue ticking. Also. Go away, trees. No one wants you. You're getting in the way. And I also need your lumber anyway, so this also works out for that. Uh, what else do I need here? Eh, I have enough Mirage Thread to get an another piece of cloth going. Okay, so what I need now is I need logs. I need a lot of logs. Also, give me these so I can go put them in if I need to. Because I'm going to make another three ingot makers. The lumber makers, I'm... Um, or not lumber. Wait. Oh, right, I need iron too.
Yeah, the lumber makers, I'm kind of okay with just having six. We don't need nearly as many of those as we need of iron. Although, I guess it wouldn't hurt to get another couple. Eh, I'll get maybe one or two more. I'll get two more. One for each. Okay. Oh, no. Give me that. I need those ones. I don't need these ones. Alright, let's get the ingot makers set down, I guess. Oh, are these all gonna... F oh, that lake is probably in the way, isn't it? Yeah, that lake's in the way. That's fine. I'll put it over here instead. And then we'll get two more lumber makers set up. So solid lumber and supple. Alright. And then all of these are iron. Ooh. I was going to say I need to go grind more iron, but literally every time we go to uh, Stonebreaker Valley, we come back with like 50 iron. Or not 50, we come back with like 500 iron. Because there's just so much of it everywhere. So I think that still works. Uh, hold on. I think I have enough thread now, too. Where's my silver? I just want to make sure these are all going at maximum capacity at all times. Like I said, Laura, don't mind that the entire, like, western side of the farm sounds like a freaking factory at this point. I have a lumber mill and, like, a metal smelting mill going on at the same time over here. It's actually kind of impressive that we managed to fit them all into these, like, tiny little boxes. Alright, we're good. So that's gonna be going for... ever. We'll keep an eye on things and uh, continue refilling them throughout the day. Alright, let's go take care of the animals. And yeah, I'm definitely gonna need to go crazy when it comes to like... Oh, honey's done. I need to go crazy later on when it comes to, like, planting all of the grass. I'm just gonna make a giant grass field. Probably to the left, honestly. I was gonna put inside the... Oh, these are done. I was gonna put it inside, like, the, uh... The barn area, but I think it might be better if I put it to the left. There's a lot of empty space there. Now I know what I can use it for. Also, why am I putting those in there? Uh, let me just put away the silver real quick, because I accidentally kept it with me. Which box did I put the bait in at this one, right? Yeah, that one. Okay. Let's go take care of the animals. They all should have eaten by now. I'm also going to go throw these in there so that I can just move my animals immediately. Because, yeah, these, uh, these smaller barn chicken coop, these are base, oops, these are basically going to be where all my older animals go. All the younger animals who are still, like, breeding are going to stay in the big ones because I need them in there. This one is, uh, it's almost like a retirement home. Might be a good idea to get another silage at some point, too. I'm going to take a quick stock of how much fodder I have right now. And yeah, I'm get At this point, I'm just going to bite the bullet and make myself another cheese and another uh, mayonnaise maker. Unfortunately, since all my animals are just so different in terms of generations, the quality of eggs I'm going to get are just going to be all over the place. It's also snowing today, so I'll just leave them on side for now. I should have probably thought up another uh, naming scheme, to be honest. Like, I like my story of Caesar's locations theme, but it kind of doesn't work when I kind of forgot just the sheer amount of animals you get in this game. Like, we have so many freaking animals, and we're still not done, by the way. There's like, I think, one or two more animals we can get in the spring. 
that we couldn't get in year one because we just weren't good enough in year one. You're being good enough. How's my skill looking? Eight enamel care. All right, not bad. That still does not sound like a proper rabbit sound. I don't know. I actually don't know what a rabbit's supposed to sound like, but I'm pretty sure it's not that. They sound like goats. Anyways, I'm gonna throw everything in the makers and then I'm gonna move everyone. Okay, and then the eggs time. Yeah, one more Manly's Maker should do it. Okay. Oh, and fodder. How are we looking? This one's empty, obviously. We are... Eh. Maybe I should buy a bit more fodder just to be safe. Okay, let's move some people over. Alright, who is going over to the doctor? Which is a... Barn? Yeah, the doctor's a barn. Okay. So let me see here. Harmonica can go over. Blue Bell can go over. Well, wait. This is going to also involve cows too, huh? Okay, in that case, let's also move some cows over. Uh, Forget-Me-Not can go over. All of town can... Well, hmm. Wolf of Town can go over. Alright, how are we doing in terms of room? We have three empty here. I'll move one... Mm, yeah, I'll move one more uh, cow over. Move over... Yeah, I'll move over all of town. There we go. Alright, we have some extra room now to uh, do a bit more breeding in here. As for you guys, Mineral Town can go over, Little Coke can go over, Flower Bud. Yeah, we can just move you all over, honestly. We're gonna have so much room for chickens. I really wish rabbits were in the chicken coop again, but honestly, we probably don't even need to do that for the chickens. Whatever. It's the barn I'm more concerned about. All right. But with that, I think we've pretty much gotten I'm going to cut down all these trees. Give me a second. There's a ton of trees here that don't need to be here. Anyways, I think I've gotten all the materials I really need, honestly, at this point. It's just kind of waiting for the makers to do their work. Oh, uh, do I have any extra spores? Hold on. I really can't see with these trees in the way. I really hope the new Story of Seasons game that's coming eventually. I do hope it's full 3D. Like, as nostalgic as the over the... Over, not over the shoulder, but like the isometric look is. I really think full 3D is kind of the way to go at this point. Just so that you don't get blocked by trees all the time. Are these done, by the way? These are done. Well, these are turning into, uh, honey, then. Okay. Anyways, with that, we're wrapping things up here. So, next time on Let's Play Story of Seasons Pioneers of Olive Town, uh, we'll just continue making our... Oh, I didn't put these away. I'll put those away later. We'll continue making our iron and wood, and... Hopefully we'll get enough pretty soon. Actually, hold on, let me do a quick bit of math. So if we get like 60 a day in terms of iron, we need 300, so that's what, five days? Actually, yeah, with the sheer amount of makers we have pumping these out, well, the silver might also be an issue. Okay, so it's probably gonna take like about a week, I think, at this rate. We'll see. I'll figure it out. So, till then.